Welcome, and thank you for taking the time to learn a bit more about the Units tab. This presentation is aimed to support all commissioners who will be using commissioner tools and is specifically about the Units tab. When you log into commissioner tools, the default screen is the Units tab when starting at a district level. This is where many of the features for a unit commissioner will start. Notice that Units is underlined, showing that you are at the Units tab. Selecting a specific unit displays that unit's dashboard. You will see the type of the unit, the unit number, the charter partner. The dashboard also shows the currently assigned unit commissioner if there is one. You will also see the current unit health status score and unit health indicators when a detailed assessment has been completed. The name of the commissioner that entered the last contact will also be listed along with information about when the last contact was made. Next to the current commissioner are three buttons, Add New Contact, Archive Contacts, and Resources. The Add New Contacts button allows a commissioner to add a simple assessment or a detailed assessment, or to schedule a detailed assessment. The Archive Contacts button is where you will find all of the recorded entries from the old unit visit tracking system. Here you will be able to see the archived entries from the Unit Visit Tracking System, or UVTS, but you will not be able to edit them. The Resources button will show you contact information for the District Key 3. The bottom of the dashboard provides a log of contacts and their status, scheduled, in progress, or complete. The dashboard also shows the type of assessment, simple, or detailed. The tilde on the unit health score indicates a simple assessment along with the name of the commissioner that made the contact. Reviewing information from previous contacts is simple. Click on the entry and a new screen appears. The left column shows the current unit health score. If this selection is a detailed assessment, the unit health indicators will show as well as the name of the assigned unit commissioner. On the right hand column at the top is a button that is labeled Review Assessment Details. Select this button to open the notes for contact. Administrative and other commissioners are able to add comments to the entry and those comments will appear under the Contact Comments bar. The final portion of the page shows any priority needs the unit may have that have been determined as part of the unit service plan. This concludes the presentation about the units tab. Please find other videos at my.scouting, the YouTube channel called Scouting Multimedia, and the Commissioner's webpage.